everyone, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's Saturday Fragrant Shakedown. I swear, it feels like it's been forever. Actually hasn't, but I'm kind of glad to be done with the self-tanning stuff. Just because I do love doing fragrance reviews. But anyway, today I do have Samba Ice um, fragrance to share with you. If you'd like to hear about this, fragrance notes, what I think of it, who I think would enjoy it, that kind of stuff, then please keep on watching. All right, I did buy this from Amazon. Oof. I'm gonna be honest, it was like over a year ago. I have a box of fragrances that it's not, it's like a lot of them are like, like little sample sizes. Now this is my last full size fragrance, but I bought this a while ago and it's just sitting in a box and I'm like, or I'm not buying stuff. I'm like, I need a fragrance. And I pulled this out a couple of weeks ago. I am so sad I waited so long to try this. But anyway, so this is the Perfumers Workshop. That's the brand it's from. And once again, it's called Samba Ice. This is 3.3 fluid ounces. I purchased this on Amazon. Like I said, it was a long time ago, but this is really affordable um, on perfume.com where you can buy like older fragrances or even newer fragrances. Um, this is around $12 for 3.3 ounces, which is your standard size for perfume. This stuff is so long lasting. Oh my gosh. Let me show you what the bottle looks like. It's so pretty. You can see I've been using this. It is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Oh my goodness. This did come out in 2002. I graduated in 2003. It's, 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 it's an older fragrance, but it smells so good. This is such a watery, like not... You know what I mean? Like if when something, someone describes some, like a fragrance is like, it's like water lily and it's, you know, it's, that's what it reminds me of. It's a very like, what I think of like a really beautiful ripper, that kind of thing. It does have notes of jasmine. Check. Love jasmine. Um, it has tuberose, amber, um, patchouli, stuff like that. So it does have a little bit of musks in it but it just ties so beautifully with the floral. I'm usually not a huge floral fan. Um, I don't like super sweet fragrances. This is sweet, but it smells so good. It is a stronger scent. So if you're someone that doesn't like a strong scent, if you like something that's a little bit more delicate, Samba Ice is not gonna be for you. But if you like a bold fragrance, you like something that will last all day long, something that grabs attention, you're gonna absolutely love Samba Ice. It is incredible, it is so good. I am I smoke cigarettes, um, which that's a strong odor, right? Nope, this will power through. Um, this is probably one of the longest lasting fragrances I've ever tried. It just, it is an absolutely gorgeous summer scent. Um, I see this being appropriate for all ages. I'm talking like high school and up. Obviously, if you have a little eight, nine, 12 year old, probably not gonna be their jam because it is a stronger scent, but it is so beautiful. I can also see this being unisex. It is a bit more feminine, but it doesn't matter. Wear what you like to wear. I like to wear some men's colognes just because the way it turns on me, it's beautiful. This, I always say, like, oh, my top three. You know, I love Bath and Body Works, um, Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. I love, um, white musk, you know, there's like a few fragrances, a handful of fragrances that I repurchase over and over again that I absolutely love. This has to be in my top five. I have so many scents, so many fragrances, but this is absolutely stunning. Oh my goodness. I wish I wasn't on a no buy. I wish that my old job would have worked out. I wish I didn't pay, take a $2 pay cut because even though I've only used that much, what, a 16th, an eighth of a bottle, I already want to purchase a backup. That's how much I like this. So if you like a strong feminine floral with the amber and um, like the woodsy scents, uh, like as the base notes, you're absolutely going to love this. It is such a beautiful scent. So, so pretty. Smells very expensive, which it's not, but it smells like it is a designer fragrance. I'm talking one that you'd have to go to like the mall to buy or whatever, or Sephora. It's amazing. Bottle is beautiful. I love kind of like the Robin 8 blue. Um, the actual scent is like 
this blue color, but then it's got little white speckles like on the bottle. It's so beautiful. So yes, definitely recommend this Samba Ice if you are looking for a new affordable summertime scent and you know that you do like strong fragrances. This is gonna be right up your alley. They also do have a men's version. So, you know, I would definitely recommend doing your research online. If you know you like certain notes, certain fragrances together, do your research, see if, the, if you would like this. Um, personally for me, um, I'm gonna assume it's all for that, like for everybody across the country, um, you can't return fragrances to Amazon just because they are flammable. For some reason they can ship them to us, but we can't ship them back. So just be aware of that. But it is so affordable that even if you don't like it, I you could probably give it to someone that would enjoy it. But I would say if you know you like a strong scent, like I said, if you know you like the bold florals with, you know, the amber and the woods and stuff, you're probably going to like this. It smells so good. It kind of reminds me of a slightly stronger, slightly more amber and woodsy um, cool water by what, what is the David off or something like that. It reminds me of cool water, not the same scent, but it's got that same sort of vibe. So if you know you like cool water, I'm not saying it's a dupe, but if you know you like cool water, you like those type of fragrances, then Samba Ice might be a good option to look into. It's got that same kind of vibe, that kind of, that water, like when I think of like, when someone's like, oh, it's like a nice aqua or, you know, it's a nice water fragrance. This is exactly what I'm thinking of. So really, really good, beautiful bottle super affordable on Amazon and it's absolutely stunning. So definitely recommend it if you're looking for that affordable summer fragrance. This is the one I would go with. But anyway, short and sweet today. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up, share it, all that jazz. Let me know down below in the comments if you've ever tried Samba Ice. If you have, what did you think of it? Love to know down below. And also just let me know down below what fragrance are you wearing for summer? I'd love to know down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do that. I do upload seven days a week, all about budget beauty. Um, every other Saturday, unless I'm doing a special skincare thing like the self tanning is fragrance. So make sure that you do subscribe if you're into fragrance. Um, but I appreciate you stopping by. Another video should start auto playing here in a moment. It might be one of mine, it might be somebody else's, but sit back, relax and enjoy. And I'll see y'all here in just a sec.